G'day guys, Elvin Pyle here from Invention Pals. I hope you guys are well. Thank you for joining us on our big lap around Australia. In this video, we are exploring the Stirling Ranges near Albany in Western Australia. The Stirling Ranges is home to Bluff Knoll, which is the second highest peak in Western Australia. It's got lots of walks to do down there. We had a really good time. We also checked out a salt lake called Bob's Lake, and we stopped in at the end of the day and had a good feed at the local bakery at Mount Barker. Check it out, I hope you guys enjoy this. Let's go. from Bluff Knoll. It's the highest peak in the Stirling Ranges National Park and it's pretty chilly here today. It's a, a mountain of, of many moods apparently. So today it's not raining but it is still quite cool. In the cooler months they even get a sprinkling of snow up there so don't say it doesn't snow in Western Australia. Alright guys, so we made it here to the car park of Bluff Knoll. From here it's a 3.1k, uh, about 3-4 to four hour hike to the summit. Apparently it's really nice up there, we can't do it today. One of the boys is asleep and it's a bit cool and we're just not really up for it. But anyways, it's still a worthwhile drive up here because the views here are pretty nice. Some nice picnic areas here and toilets and stuff. So come down here to check out the Stirling Ranges. This Bluff Knoll is the highest peak of the, uh, the Stirling Ranges um, mountain range. Uh, we're going to go from here, we're going to head west and check out a bit more of the, um, the mountains. So let's go. Alright guys, we are exploring Stirling National Park. It's a Stirling National Park drive. It's a 42 km dirt road, pretty good condition and there's heaps of mountain peaks around. Some very unique looking mountain peaks and there's lots of walks and hikes we can do. Uh, right now we are standing on top of Mount Mark. There's a pretty rugged and narrow track getting up here. The rocks are really sharp but we managed to ride with our little keys and the view here is quite nice. It's a um, very overcast day today which kind of makes it um, nice and cool at least for walking. So yeah, I hope you guys uh, enjoy the view from up here. Okay guys, we are still in the Stirling Range National Park. We are the western viewpoint here. And I just want to mention that even though it's not actually peak season for wildflowers, the wildflowers can be found year round here. And in this little southwest pocket of Australia, there's some very unique flora and fauna that's only found in this area. So it's very interesting. It's very cool for us anyway. I'm a bit of a nerd for that, it's, um, those things. But yeah, just thought I'd mention that. 
and we're gonna keep looking around and see what else we can find. Okay guys, so we're taking the long way home from the Sterling Ranges and we detoured to check out, um, this is called Bob's Lake here, and it is in Cranbrook. There's a heap of, like, looks like salt lakes scattered around the area. Some of them are even pink. This one is not. It's, the water here is pretty low, but it's a good little beach for the uh, boys to walk around in, muck around, see what we can find. S seeing some dog tracks here. I don't know if they're dingoes or, or pets or not, um, but anyways, we'll see what else we can find. I had the drain up, so I'll show you a bit of footage of that. Hey, this monkey. How's it going, mate? Yeah. What are we doing? What are we doing? It says no dingoes and crabs. <laughs> he does not say that at all. What's going on, mate? What's it say? What did he find? Did you find anything cool yet? Yeah. What did you find? It's all dingo tracks. Dingo tracks. <laughs> My turn, wait, can I have a bite? Well guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope you got something useful out of it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up to let us know you're enjoying it. And we'll catch you on the next one. See ya.